How's it going, everyone? It's Reversal Trader King, where I catch you guys bottoms and tops in the stock market. A lot of people want me to do a video on CRKN, so here's my video on CRKN, and I'm going to give you guys honest, no pumping, just real honest advice of what I think is your best scenario. Obviously, in hindsight, it's a lot easier to say, you know, what could happen, but I'm going to try to predict what's going to happen before this move up happens or the move down so what you're looking at is a daily time frame and if you people that watch my youtube channel a lot you kind of understand what you're looking at so be patient for the new people that are coming in what you're looking at is the band strategy it's probably one of the most effective strategies because it, it takes no bias into the price action when price goes over the upper band what does price do it sells off um do we know how high it can go we know that the max it will go is an 8 atr that is your average to range what we're using right here is about a 4 atr and that is really good for normal market conditions um oftentimes i i don't like to do this all the time but if it is at like a 7 or 8 atr i will take a short position um on my own accord and make you know easy profits to that upper band if it's well above it we know where price has to go. Um, it can't sustain above the bands and where price usually goes to in a short term uh, uh, area is your EMA5 and that's going to be your purple band. The purple band, um, and, and if you guys don't know EMAs, this is exponential moving averages. This is where price goes to to revert to the mean. EMA5 is a shorter time frame so it's going to go to it faster. It's going to go to the EMA 10 a little longer and then EMA 20. In this certain case, it went to it faster than I would have expected. So uh, what, what you want to do is, um, and, and before I get too into the video, guys, if you do want to join the premium Discord, it is only six borrows a month. I'll put the link down below in the YouTube comments. Um, I'll pin it. it. It really is a good system. You're going to want to have this. So when when people are pumping bizarre price targets, and you see, like, let's say, for example, you see the upper band way up here at 43 cents. Sure, it can go a little higher. If anyone is saying, like, this is going to a dollar, two dollars, you know, you really need to start having some red flags up and be like, um, according to the average true range, you're, you're going to have sell-offs. You're going to go back to your EMA. Like, can it do this absolutely over a massive amount of time with the volume constantly being there? So I try to keep it real to you guys. If you want to join the Discord, um, it's always available for you guys for 20 cents a day. And you can find that in the comments below. So a lot of you guys know my bread and butter plays. Um, before I go into this momentum type of trade of why I like it, my bread and butter players is, wasn't going to be this one. It'll be right in here. When you know that price is going to hit the EMA 10 and 20, we haven't hit the 20 all the way since here. We're getting close to the lower band and we're under the EMA 5 down in this area with time distance of EMA 10 for at least two to three weeks. This right here was a nice solid entry to target the EMA 10 here and here. And then you could have obviously brought in a lot of dips here and there. Um, and in hindsight, yes, this one exploding move up all the way up, you know, way up in here if you if you um got it but the, the the key to trading really is is buying buying stocks when they're depressing buying you know if there's a lot of people let's say on stock twits or forums and everyone's complaining i've seen it over and over again and sure the stock might be absolutely junk and you want to get good entries you don't want to just be like buying every dip you want to make sure it is calculated where the inverse where you buy it at the bottom band right um I'm, I'm just looking at some back tests there wasn't as much signals for a buy zone compared to a sell zone this thing has just been going down rapidly fast but as you can see they it does have nice spikes but you got to be wary the spikes are getting shorted really fast um and where does price go back to your ema5 in the very fast amount of time right um and we look at this this is beautiful and this is why a lot of people who short make a ton of money. They see this and they see where the overextensions are. Like this candle here was a beautiful short entry. Here was setting up, but I would have missed it. So let's look at the current action. If we're going to trade a momentum trade, I put smaller amounts of money because they're penny stocks. Anybody that says put all your freaking account in it and um, you're, you're gambling. 
Everything in stocks is probabilities. You can't say 100% certain it's going to do this. But if I backtest and let's say 80% of the time it does it, that means you have an edge in the market. And so if you're winning 80, more than 80% on a momentum type of trade, you should be winning more. You know, you should gain way more than you lose. But you got to have, you know, the proper stop loss, which not a lot of people tell you. So I'm going to discuss this. So we knew not to take the trade up in the upper band. All my Discord members should know this. Everyone should know this. And I'm going to keep repeating it and repeating it and repeating it. If you're getting greedy, look at the chart. And everyone that doesn't have this system, let them lose the money. Let them take the hit. You know, we always need people to lose money in the stock market. I'm totally fine with that. Because there's got to be losers for winners to happen. So... Price will hit the EMA5. Anything that doesn't hit the EMA5 in one week is super long. We Where do we correct to? The EMA5 here. And this is usually your bounce effect. As you can see, we hit the EMA5 and we have a little bounce. It's not the best scenario for getting in heavy. The EMA10 is what I call the trampoline effect. Once price hit the trampoline right here on this ye yellow band, that's when you have a nice area to get in. Because you had this massive big move down, there's going to be rebounds or what you call, you know, the dead cat is what some like to say. So right in here was a beautiful gain all the way up in here to here. Now, where I really like to see the trend was, you know, really start going up and, get, and really get some bull move is that EMA 20. This is your last line of defense, guys. This has to hold. Um, I am very lenient because we know price has to hit the EMA 20. It just did it in a very fast time frame. So now price reverted to the mean. And now we can go up for a move higher. This is looking gorgeous, guys. So I called this with GME too. Um, I'll show you the same thing uh, in another video. But I called it. It did the kind of the same pattern. Everyone made, you know, was dissing on it. After hours to release something and we're going up. So... Right in here, we have the EMA 20 to a T. Wick goes under it a little and price closes over it. What I would like to see is one. So if you have it down here, you want to have a stop loss, a good bit of distance, you know, where it don't just like hit your stop loss. I would say about, you know, you could do it under this candle actually to be the safest. But, you know, now you're kind of like increasing your stop a little too much. I would say about 10 to, Probably 10 to 15% loss down under the, this EMA 20 is what I would do in, in my if you were going to trade it. So momentum trades, um, don't ever put like your whole account on it. But I really see this as being a very positive outcome. We had a high of 60 cents. We pumped all the way down to 10 cents. And we hit the EMA 20. So we reverted to the mean. Algos did what they had to do. And now we can go up for the move higher. Guys, this is looking good. I'm telling you, for the risk versus reward, I would take this type of trade. I, I really do like it. Um, we did everything we had to do. We hit the 5, we hit the 10, we hit the 20. Now we go for the move higher. Uh, it's looking really, really nice. So we got our uh, trend line respecting here. Um, this is so... What we really want to do is just kind of like getting out of here. And we might even have um a situation like you know kind of like this don't hold me accountable to it but i guarantee you we can get way up in here and try to get a nice move up so i like to trade on what i see that works i've done this a lot where you'll see price hit the ema20 ema20 is where the big move happens that's when price has to go somewhere you'll see it consolidate and that's totally fine if price consolidates in here and the bands get narrow that's fine because then it's in a resting period and it's for a big move. But you do want to take your entries here, not up in here, up in here, all the way up in here. God, you know, Lord willing, no one did that. Um, or even up here. Let it come down to you. There is a way to get good entries. You know, you don't have to just randomly throw darts at price. If you guys want to join the premium Discord and how to get this system on your charts, how to utilize it properly on how to use my bread and butter type of trades that made me consistent and stay in the market for over six years. I've done a lot of strategies. You know, I've done so many strategies. You probably, it'll blow your mind. Um, advanced option strategies. None of them really worked. 
other than this strategy right here because it's it, it really is simple you don't have to make trading complicated it really can be simple some people you know the smartest people in the world lose in trading because you know they overcomplicate it they it's a bunch of probabilities is all it is it's not you know you don't have to be right all the time it's 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 always about are you more right than you're wrong so in this trading system i developed a system that catches the bottom reversals before the move happens because those are your lower risk type of trades once a move happens we go into the momentum type of trades which is what i showed you you have a big move up you look for price to consolidate and that's usually at your EMA 20 and you take the move higher, clear stop loss, and you're done. It's, it's as easy as that gets, guys. If you guys want to join, I'll put the link down below into the YouTube comments and YouTube description. It'll be pinned. It'll say join the premium discord for my alerts and system. When you click that link, it'll take you to this free chat landing page. What you want to do is go on over. First, read how to subscribe. Look at some of this stuff. Um, basically, what this talks about is when you hit premium chat under subscriptions, You'll be opted in to subscribe and all these channels will be unlocked when you do that do it on your computer because it is cheaper than on your phone because your phone will charge you an ios fee i'm trying to help you guys out i'm trying to make it the cheapest i could possibly do it and six bucks it really is i think the cheapest and the most value you guys are going to get i am going to add live streams i've been saying that i know and i'm really working on how to develop my schedule because um, we have a lot of baby appointments so I am adding that I'm trying to add as most value I can because I wish I had something like this of transparency but, um, before I started trading what you're gonna get in here is RTK swing trades which is me you get my exact entries and exits in this kind of format um, education videos how to properly accumulate reversals uh, use these indicators to be profitable so stuff like that that will advance your uh, trading even more and have an edge over people that uh, don't have this. Um, RTK Journal is you can see my active trades so you don't have to ever say what trades are you in and you can see my averages and how long I held them with my wins and losses. So I try to, um, and this is pure facts and nothing, I'm not trying to like, you know, fingers crossed and bloat my ego on this. I really, I'm telling you guys, it is a good trade system there's no perfect system and be like you know you do this you're gonna be instantly profitable and you won't experience any emotional pain trading is your number one psychology if you can control psychology that is your biggest factor in losing you know once you have a system you have to get your emotions control i've seen traders be down five percent and they're freaking out they don't know what to do they start shaking they cut it for a loss and guess what price goes up um it, it's just part of how trading works it, it, it messes with your mind but i promise you if you have a system and you stick to it and you follow to the what you what the rules is then that's all you have to do you know you've got if you have to walk away from your computer and not look at it that that's fine but stick to your system and not worry about what other people are saying on the forums i like to buy when price is depressing it's it's definitely helped me a lot so I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I hope to join. I hope to you guys have joined the premium Discord. You will get a lot of value out of it. And there's also a community to help. You know, we have over 3,000 members, so you're gonna learn a lot from other people. And I have actually. And so um, if you guys like the video, give it a like, subscribe, comment. I hope to you see your comments in the video. It helps the engagement. And if you like, it does mean a lot. And I, I read all the comments. So thank you so much, guys. Peace out. This is my CRKN analysis, Crown Electric. I'm bullish because we have reverted to the mean. And at the EMA 20, we make our next big move up. We had a nice high of 60 cents back down to 10. Why can we not hit um, at least, you know, right in this area again, and then break of that for a move higher? Let's see, guys. All right, peace out, guys. Happy trading. Hope to see you in the Discord, and much love.